Food insecurity is a growing crisis across the country. hy V is looking for ways to help across their eight state region. Our own Theodore Mito joins us live from the Grimes hy V with more on this project. Good morning, Theodora. Good morning, Justin. Yeah, hy V is undergoing an initiative to help fight hunger, and they're doing that by helping provide 100 million meals to food pantries. And the way that that works is that customers can come, and when they check out at a hy V, they can choose to round up to the nearest dollar. For every dollar that's donated, 10 meals will be given to food banks. And joining me now is Ty, Bob, and Jan, all with the food bank. So, Ty, food insecurity is a huge problem. So, why is it important to find a solution? I think it's important to find a solution because, like you said, it is a growing problem. Um, it's not something that's going to just go away with you know, government support to food banks, things like that. And I think we understand that to lead a healthy and happy, full life, you have to have access to nutritional food. Yeah, and Bob and Jan, both of you are volunteers for the food bank. So why do you volunteer and why is it important? I think volunteering is important because it creates awareness of certain issues that you might not be aware of. And as Ty talked about, it's, it's a pretty widespread problem. Um, in Iowa, we've got over, over 300,000 people that face food insecurity, and it's a chance to give back to the community in, in one way or another, and people think that well, I can only volunteer an hour here, an hour there. No matter what they do volunteer-wise, it's going to make a difference whether it's an hour or a day or whatever because uh, you know, the certain causes need attention and need help to, uh, to solve those problems. And there's a real need. You want to help people get food on the table for their families so their families can thrive and really um, be, be what it can be for their potential. And so for us, it's, a, it's also a way not only giving back to the community, but to um, actually have a community ourselves as well. And so a lot of the volunteers will come on the same day um, and, and we get to know each other and while we're serving, serving the uh, greater Iowa area. Yeah, and also joining me right now is Leanne, who's a teacher and associate for the Ankeny School. So Leanne, the Food Bank of Iowa says that about 15% of uh, children are food insecure. So what do you see and is that a concern for you? Very much a concern. Um, we provide a healthy breakfast for the kids in the morning, a good lunch at lunchtime. But so many of those kids come to school so hungry and we don't know if they're going to get a meal at the end of the day. And so we try to provide help try to provide healthy snacks for the kids and we're so grateful to have parent volunteers that will bring things in students will bring stuff from home but sometimes that just isn't enough and so this is uh, something I'm very uh, seriously hoping will make a difference just by being able to provide snacks healthy snacks for the kids yeah and yeah. so this is just one initiative Justin that is going on that can really help with food insecurity because it is a growing problem here in Iowa Getting bigger and bigger every day and every nickel, every dime counts in this uh, resource that's available. Thank you, Theodora Mito, reporting live from Grimes.